so um, we are we're at the hospital. You ready for mommy to have her baby? Yeah. Are you ready to be a big brother? Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna go have the baby right now. Yeah, right now. Four minutes apart. She's gotta go. Okay. All right. Bye. Bye, guys. Just walking this baby out, I think. Yeah. Number four, though, should should be a piece of cake. Okay. Says yeah. the husband. <laughs> we got lost that. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? You don't look like you're in labor. I am in labor. I'm, I'm, a not, I'm not having a contraction right now, but they are painful. So, Kristen's in triage she's uh, she's comfortable um, but uh, I just had to come out here to get our, our overnight bag because uh, this, this baby's coming today <clears throat> I get can I just I gotta take a second like <laughs> mothers in delivery and babies I mean just like it's crazy I mean she's amazing I mean amazing how calm and relaxed she is. It's like growing a human being. It's like, I don't know, it's crazy. Freaking my hero, for sure, my hero. <clears throat> no, I can't lose when I wake up sleeping um, just wanted to tell you our thought process on making a name we are notoriously really bad at picking names uh, none of our kids had names before they were born and um, usually takes us hours to really solidify that we want to see them first um, but names mean a lot to us all of our kids we picked names that had really significant meanings to us. Um, family names as well. We just, we always want to honor, you know, the people that came before us. Um, so we finally arrived at the name Leo Hoyer Zale. You know, my great-grandfather used to go by the last name Donovan uh, simply because no one was hiring Polish immigrants. Uh, so he went by the last name Donovan just to get a job. My grandfather, at the age of 18, ended up legally changing our name. Uh, it used to be Zeleskevich or Zaleskevich, depending on you know like where you're from in, in Poland. And um, so he shortened it to Zale because he felt like he couldn't get a job as a salesman, an electrician, um, with a last name like that. We ended up finding out that Leo is the name of one of my great uncles, uh, my grandma's side, who died in World War II at the age of 23, so I never met him. Um, but how cool is that? Like, we're, we're, we love the name and we're just thrilled that there's an extra meaning behind that. And the reason that we went with Poyer uh, for the middle name, that's Kristen's maiden name, and her father had three girls and uh, we just wanted to help him carry on the name. So that's, that's pretty much the reason we picked all those names. Leo means lion and Poyer means powerful, so.
you the best gift that could ever happen. Coffee? <laughs> they gave me decaf today. Ew. What is even the point of decaf? It doesn't even taste like coffee. <laughs> 